of the week. We're standing in the wrong spot, apparently. <laughs> this is Neville. He's our pet of the week. He's just a little baby. He's here with Lee Turbert. Lee actually brought Neville in here the other way around. <laughs> Tell us about Neville, who is just a puppy and really wants to play. He does. <laughs> He's only two months old. You can see his paws. They are going to be big. His mom was a German Shepherd, so he's got that German Shepherd oh, in him. You've got so much to say, Neville. You're telling us so much. And he wants to play, 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 but he's going to be a beautiful pet. He really will. Once he gets neutered, he'll calm down. So he's fostered with intent right now until he gets okay. his surgery. And then he'll get his microchip and his shots, and he'll be able to go home with you permanently. Now, Neville, you just wanted to snuggle a minute ago. Maybe that's what we need to do. Huh? We just need to get you sweet and snuggled. What do we need to do to adopt Neville if we're interested? All they have to do is go to our website, MontgomeryHumane.com, and complete an application. Then we will give you a call and set up an appointment that you can come in and meet Neville. And if this is the baby you want to take home, you could do it. And we'll get his surgery scheduled, and then you can finalize the adoption. How's the shelter looking right now? I know the holidays tend to tend to clear things out, but yes. then they also tend to bring a lot of babies back. Right now, I mean, we are very low on puppies. Okay. Um, we have a lot of teenage dogs and, of course, adult dogs. Um, of course, we have ki cats and kittens. So if, um, if you're looking for a beautiful pet that you did not get for the holidays, it's a great gift to give yourself. It sure is. What do we need to know about uh, not just Neville, but any of the other pets? When we start to consider adding a pet to our family, what do we need to really consider and understand about bringing somebody home? It's a it's a commitment. It is a, a average of a 15 year commitment. It's not like okay, I'm tired, I want to bring them back. This is a commitment to your pet. Um, of course, you know, taking him to the vet every single year, getting his shots, getting his um, heartworm preventative. We have so many animals that come in that are heartworm positive that we have to uh, medicate. So all of those things, you know, good food, a lot of um, walks, <laughs> yeah. a, a lot, you know, to get that energy out of him, playing with them, paying attention to them. I know. You're just so cute, Neville. We're going to find you a good home, someone who's going to do a lot of playing with you. You need, you need some little people who can run around a good yard with you. What do you need at the shelter? If we can't bring home a pet, what, how can we help? Always shredded paper, newspaper, um, cleaning supplies, of course, paper towels, simple things like that. Of course, blankets, toys, and treats for the cats and, and the dogs. Wow, because, you know, dogs like Neville, they need some treats. Yeah, look at them. Do you toys. see yourself now? Look, Neville, you are so yeah. handsome. Thank you for coming in and introducing yourself. It's been so fun to meet you. Thank you for being here, Lee. Thank you.